I am in favor of ban. I think it would be good. Also, how does this, like, 25 power, 3 faction aggro deck always have perfect influence? Like, it's fucked up. I played, like, one game against them in my life where they didn't have perfect influence. Got it. Find the way. Oh, hey. Okay. Let's try to do the iron into lumen thing. Hey there, Necto the Cray. What up? Oh, it's gonna work. He played depleted. Oh, baby. So even if I get harsh ruled, I'm gonna get two cards out of it. And if he plays a vanquish on it, then like obviously I just got a two for one. Yeah, I know your turn is definitely correct sometimes. Like anytime that it, the ambush isn't relevant, like you're not going to surprise somebody. Yeah, had a Pier 5. Whatever, still a 2 for 1. Oh, but Pier 5 means I can't Dark Return. It's so sad. Should play this. Uh, so I'm just looking for, like, Azendel now. Not looking for power. This probably demands a harsh rule all by itself, honestly. Like, this is kind of a lot of damage. And get by with only 5 influence and it's 25 power 3 faction aggro deck? That's still really steep. I just annihilate that. Right, let's draw a card first. Yeah, I'm into it. This probably forces some sort of response. No. Mega Torch. That's that's a response. be good. Get me towards Azendel. Actually, I should just, like, Dark Return and Ion to, like, brick this guy. Definitely don't want to use this. I want to save that for the big guys later on. But I'm okay using one Dark Return and Ion here. So this is basically just a removal spell for that. And I'm fine using a removal spell on that. <laughs> Are you a really fan of banning highway? I think the deck is really stupid in high roll. It is certainly not fun to lose to, but I don't think fun to lose to should be a qualifier, really. But it doesn't doesn't really have interesting counterplay. It's just like, if they have it, you get fucked. And if they don't have it, then, like, you're fine. <laughs> I just don't think that it promotes interesting play patterns at all. Also, it's a burn deck that's like mono charge in a game where counter spells don't exist. Which is just kind of fucking stupid, because, like, how are you supposed to interact with that? Because whenever you're not constantly punished for playing an aggro deck? Now we're devolving with the greedy three faction mid players playing Cookbook and Azendel? So, would we rather just play Charge Pile? Is that what you're saying? I have a Desert Marshal? I got Bars here, though, so this is fine. This is basically just a one for one. We both lose a marginal value extra card. Actually, the power is super valuable to me. I need to get up to eight. Wait, so Sangularity, are you saying that you think Haunted Highway adds 
fun and decision points to the game. Like, you can play around it sometimes, but more often than not, you can't. And it's just, if they have it, you die. And I, don't, I, don't, I guess I just don't think that's that fun. I was kind of hoping for another power to ult this guy right away. Well, there it is. But this is also just, like, a very good card. Oh, uh, how greedy am I? I take the spell. Nah, fuck it. I'm maximally greedy. I mean, people still play Hailstorm, but the problem is that, like, playing Lightning Strike and stuff isn't good enough. Am I supposed to play this? Yeah, I think I am. It's like throws the activation on this. Banish kills a cookbook. He hasn't played one yet. Also kills Zuberry. I, I think I'm gonna keep Banish. I'm basically just trying to like extract maximum value from every card here. Warped Heart. That's pretty good. But I guess I just make a huge guy, which which he can then vanquish, but. Then that's one fewer vanquish. I go down to 32, then I play Varvara. But, like, it's not like playing Lightning Strike beats Highway either. Like, I'm playing this deck with four Banish and 12 Lifesteal guys. I'm getting fucked by it repeatedly. <laughs> like, I don't think that just adding four Lightning Strike and four Hailstone to your deck is going to beat it. The way to beat it is to only play one unit with four health and th five health and th two strength. And never play another unit. And... Uh... <laughs> what else do you have to do? Then, like, hold up a ton and ton and ton of fast interaction. And never play any unit that has an effect like Infiltrate. And never play two units at once. I'm like, I don't know. I just kind of think the meta is better when time decks are playable. Because, uh... I don't know, I just feel like time decks get beat by a lot of stuff. And it's, uh... You can play aggro, mid-range, or, like, control slash combo in a meta like that. Oh, interesting. He didn't. He just sacrificed that. Oh, because then this is bigger than my guys. Yeah, yeah, okay. That makes sense. If Banish isn't a good card against Highway, then Lightning Strike isn't a good card against Highway. Like, you're trading down one mana to kill their guy. I mean, Steward was, like, medium against it. Not great. Well, I get the Cold Ball that at least. Grab Azendel. And I've got two Azendels a coming. I don't know. I'm, I just think Highway is dumb. I'm just railing at it because I just lost to like Madness Bullshit two games in a row out of a deck that's playing 12 Lifesteal. <laughs> Whoa, he's attacking? I guess I don't want to get blown up by Torch, so let's take it. Fuck, 11, 11. It's so big. I guess it is just a ground pound at the end of the day, so Azendel is good against it. Ooh, and I do cookbook. Well, now I want to play this for sure. Alright, let's greet him. Time was metal, I gotta be hated out by Xenon. I don't think that's true at all. You know, you can also beat Highway by playing like Lumen Defender, which I just think is an underplayed card. I Maybe mean, I just should just be playing Lumen Defender decks. I don't know, everyone always says aggro is unplayable, and then people always play aggro and win, and I don't know. Like, Vara doesn't even that good against Skycrag. Like, they just permafrost it. It's way it's way worse than Titan. And Titan has been around against Skycrag since day one, and Skycrag has always been fine. So, like, I don't see how having another Brutal 4-drop that's less brutal than the already existing Brutal 4-drop kills the deck. And if you're just playing, like, Cookbook and Asenal Greed Piles, then you can just play something like... Torching them, sure. You can just play something like, uh... Uh... Temporal, and, like, 
have a 90% win rate against them. Like, Temporal is never losing against the Cookbook Greed Pile. That is a lot of removal, sir. A lot of removal. Torchbank Defender, or Torchbank Desert Marshal. I just jump this. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna play another Azendel, so I can chump that away. This thing isn't too scary anyways, it just trades for Ion. Right, I think I have to play Azendel again. I know I don't think I can just sit here and cookbook right now. much as I would love to. Well, maybe I could. Like, I'm at 30. If I take 11, I'm still at 19. Yeah, maybe I should have just cookbooked instead. Like, passed up. I think I had to pass up on the turn before we also had Zubarrier. I think this turn I could have cookbooked first. Slamming. Alright, so we're getting harsh rolled. Nice harsh rule in your 20 unit deck. Start cooking them up. <laughs> All right, that's fine. You know, it's okay. I think I will play that next turn. All right, I guess I'm just gonna play it now so that I can play Azendel plus uh, Cook. I hate Harsh Rule. I don't know. Harsh Rule is, like, pretty easy to beat. Unless it's backed up by Cookbook. Then it gets rough. Right. This makes me think he doesn't have a Harsh Rule. Because why would he commit this card to the board if he was just going to Harsh Rule the known Azendel the next turn anyways? Or maybe he just wanted to Lifesteal Train 7 while there was a chance and he wasn't going to have a chance later. Oh, he found his firebomb. Got him. That's from the cookbook that I blew up with Banish like 100 turns ago. Yeah, Harsh Rule is format defining, but super fair. Like, Harsh Rule is like Torch or Valkyrie Enforcer. Well, I mean, I think it's worse than Valkyrie Enforcer, but like, Harsh Rule is like Torch. I don't know. Right, so I did have Harsh Rule. Just kind of threw away that guy to Drain 7. Can't say I'm a big fan. All right, I'm going to save this iron for a little bit later and just keep on cooking here. Draw another iron. Well, I should quarry first. Another Azendel. Well, that's that's a good one. Uh, that just spends power to draw a card. I don't want to spend power when I'm already spending power to draw cards. Right, I'm gonna leave one back to play around Harsh Rule. Okay. Well, then I'm just gonna play the other one if he's gonna torch it. Uh, I don't have any more Azendels in here. No! My Azendel was silenced! And Andy's got a harsh rule? What is this? Played two Azendels and three Dark Returns. Just played three harsh rules. <laughs> and four Whirling Duos. I don't think Whirling Duo is good at this matchup, so that's like whatever. But it's just kind of funny. Uh, yeah, I'll put that away. Uh, actually, what do I want to get here? Theurge, I guess. I can get Mask of Torment. Let me try to work my way up to 20. I think Theurge is actually better in that case, though. Let's see. I want to play this. Five left. I might as well thin a power out of my deck. If he kills this and hits me for three, I don't care at all. Alright, so that's Heart of the Vault. 
I already killed the Akaria. It could also be Rizan, I guess. Could just get Merchant and grab another Akaria. Snap it off the block. I don't need the power at all. Yeah, heart of the Vault, sure. Yep. Let's get to kill it. It's fine. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so good at this game. As soon as he plays a couple units, I play an Azadel and force the harsh rule. You know how we do. Actually, this might be a good time to hit with this. Nope. I tried. Why isn't FJS playing Seraph? I don't know. I mean, fourth harsh rule is fine here. I don't give a shit. Like, it kills more of his stuff than does of mine. That's a three for one in my favor. All right, and he doesn't even have it. He's just purifying the Azadel. Well, now I'm just going to trade. Should have attacked first if that was your plan. No, he's hanging back. All right. Actually, let's scout first. I'm not really worried about firebombs, so I'll just bottom that and get a new card. Oh, <laughs> Darkisher. Oh, you don't say. <laughs> Play my seventh Azendel of the game, and then pass. <laughs> I don't care how many Arsenals you got. I got seven Azendels. 